if you look at the electoral resolution, you will find people talking about increasing of the defense budget. You will find people talking about training the army to be more offensive. You will find people talking about war. You will find people talking about any kind of consequences, any kind of clash. Why not to be an optimistic and why not to bring an optimistic change? If you are talking about defense, if you are talking about the increasing the budget of defense, why don't we talk about growth? If you are talking about to be offensive, why not to be supportive? If we are telling the people to be more offensive, why aren't we telling them to be more supportive? So that we can go inside a country and we can change the education system of there, we can help them solve their problems and we can help them build their opportunities for themselves or we can motivate them or inspire them into the practical world and into the virtual world. Why not to be supportive? We are talking about war, why not to talk about peace? Why not to promote peace? These are the things which we have to do. Look, this is a fact that you won't find any religion supporting violence. Take the example of Islam, take the example of Hinduism, Christianity, Sikhism, Judaism, Buddhism. You won't find any religion talking about promoting of violence. You will always find all the religions talking about peace and promoting peace. And Islam is the biggest example.